Alright, part 6 is finally in session with Bailey Suman on Skype. What up, folks? And, um, it's been a while since I did this, so I decided I should do this. And, um, anyways, let's get started. First tape I got is the surprise I got on Wednesday, and that is the 2005 VHS of Hitch. Yep. And this is a rare tape. Laugh out loud funny says shot in works Fox TV. What's rare inside the tape? And there's the tape. Really rare. Print dates February 28, 2006. And I upload the opening on Daily Motion. I left the link and I put the link in my news um my new my news um nine I mean, September 24th, 2014. The one that has the, um, me, I mean, the, the video that has me having difficulties on Daily Motion uploading it. But I finally got, I got it uploaded and I sent the link. Next tape I got is Batman Returns. What? It has the Sony Pictures Home Entertainment logo on the tape with the Columbia TriStar Home Entertainment logo. Yes, it does. Next, Batman. What? With the DVD music. Yes, it does. Next, Batman Returns. Michael Caine, Danny Video, the De the Vito, and Michelle Pfeiffer. By the way, I upload the opening on Daily Motion because I don't want to get copyright on YouTube. Plus, the opening's 15 minutes long, almost. Um, yeah. Here's the ink label, and the print dates are September 22nd, anti two, and September 8th, anti two. Are you there? Yeah. What What was that? What? Um, I heard, no, like, noises. What was that? Nothing. I didn't make a noise. Oh, it sounded like a noise uh, for some reason. Next, Italian Job. 2004 VHS with Mark Wahlberg. Chilis Theron and Edward Norton. Two thumbs up, even Roper. Full file entertainment says someone Adams, US Weekly. Gang Gab could even. Have you seen the Italian job? Yeah, it's alright. Bach was stickers from March 21st to 4. The Italian job is hot, says Kevin Thomas, Los Angeles Times. Let alone hot ticket. Feels like smooth, exciting. Wolf's down ski slope, says Stephen Holton, New York Times. Here's the sticker label and the blockbuster label. Next tape of guys, Lethal Weapon 4. The gang's all here. Extra feature going behind the scenes of the cast and crew. Mel Gibson, Dan Danny Glover, Joe Pesci, Renee Russo, Chris Rock, and Jet Li. Richard Donner film. That was Have probably the weakest Lethal Weapon movie in the trilogy. I've not seen the others. So I've only seen this one. This one's okay. I like the first. High Voltage Entertainment, Fast Furious, Previously Funny, David Sheehan, CBS TV. I'm hoping to get the other three in VHS sometime. It's the only one I have on VHS for some reason. Tape, April 22nd, nine is the print date. Next tape, guys, Tombstone. Kurt Russell, Van Kilmer, one of the ten, I mean, the ten years best, says Kevin T.K. Cop, Los Angeles Times. Every town is a legend. I mean, a story. Every tombstone is a legend. Kurt Russell, Vancouver, terrific. Sneak previews. Here's the tape. Burnt dates, May 18th, Type 4. Holographic sticker right there. Next tape, I got is Parenthood. With Steve Martin, Tom Hills, Rick, Mick Roman, Rick, ugh, Rick Moranis, Martha Flemington. K.R. Reeves, Jason Bovards, Mary Stilbergen, Dan West, a Ron Howard film. It could happen to you. And by the way, have you seen Tombstone? Yeah. What do you think of it? Pretty good movie. Have you seen Paranut? Oh, yeah. Diary up. Diary up. Yeah. Here's the sticker label, is the end label. Next tape I got is Arachophobia. Two thumbs up, Cisco Niebuhr, Thrilling, ABC TV, Fun 
at the movies, Rex Reed, a roller coaster ride of a movie says, Good Morning America. Have we seen Arachophobia? Yeah, it's uh, kind of a strange movie, but it's still pretty good. I have to agree with you. Thrills and comedy to CBS TV, entertaining, Fox TV New York, it's great, NBC TV New York. Here's the sticker label, print dates March 19th, 1991. Next is Tootsie, Dustin Hoffman. This is a hilarious movie. Have you seen Tootsie? No. You should. It's a great movie. I'll have to watch it. The sticker label's crooked for some reason, but oh well. Now it gets to some tape to six tapes without cases. Heavyweights, nice time five VHS, stick a label version, recommend hit copy of friends, please rewind tape. Have you seen heavyweights? Oh yeah, I have it on VHS too. Does yours have the sticker label? No, it has an ink label. Oh god, I love heavyweights. So do I. Per dates, July twelfth, nineteen ninety five. I know Jacob Meckling has the D V D version of it. Yep. By the way, if you want to know who Jacob Meckling is, he's a friend of ours on Skype. I mean, not on Skype, on Uvu. Blech. I'm Skyped up right now. Next is Bill Cosby's Picture Pages, Volume 3. And this is actually um, an old Walt Disney tape from the 1980s. 50 cent charts of tapes not rewound. As you can see by the tan lid. Birthday is June 1st to tape 5. Next tape we got is Land for Time Journey of Big Water, 2005 HS with Black Reels, but I did not care for the movie, but I'm gonna, I got it because I'm going to give it another chance. Cracked in the lens and two cracks on the back, and there's no print date on it. Next is Pluto, Cartoon Classics Volume 2, Tan Lid again, and print date's December 12th, Tape 3. Look how old the reels are. Next is Walt Disney Comedy and Magic Review. Burnt dates October 15th at day 5. Please be kind and rewind. Next is Treasure Island. Please rewind tape. No burnt date on this one. Tim Lid. Anyways, now let's get to the clamshells finally. Let's finally get to the clamshells. I have quite a bit of Disney clamshells, but that's okay. Next is the um, first one is 1994 which is the Harriet the Spy. Have you seen Harriet the Spy? Yeah. It's not that great. I thought it was okay. This tape is damaged at the end of the movie. Here's the sticker label. Here's the end label. This tape's from 1996, I think. Next tape I got is... Sleeping Beauty, 1997 VHS, fully restored, limited edition, THX certified. A unmasked vert vision of a world of poetry, magic and adventure, Los Angeles Times, THX certified. Have you seen Sleeping Beauty? Yeah, I've seen every single Disney movie. I know they're going to re-release it on Blu-ray sometime soon. I mean... Oh, they re they remade um, Snow White and Seven Dwarfs called Maleficent. That movie looks like shit. It did, but I saw the movie, and it was okay. Uh, I don't know. It was okay. Uh, roughly okay. Print dates June 10th, it's high 7th. Next tape I got is C Spot Run. Smart one isn't wearing any pants. I have to agree. This movie is a little bit stupid, but um, it is what it is. Larry Streets is Bill Dial ABC Radio Network. Here's the sticker label and the print dates August 1st, 2001. But um, this movie is kind of stupid, but you can't help watching it. Next tape I got is. Honey, we shrunk ourselves. Rick Moranis, an all new full length motion picture. Have you seen Honey, we shrunk ourselves? I've seen all of them. They're all good, in my opinion. I'm hoping to get the others in VHS sometime. 
Disney brings you big time fun for the whole family. Here's the sticker label and the print dates, February 13th, 1997. And a Tour for Hollywood video label. Fortunately, it's cracked right there, but uh, oh well. Next tape I got is the Road to El Dorado. Sorry. Something fell. Sorry, guys. I mean, like a key fell. Thumbs up. Roger Ebert. Roger Ebert, the movies. Solid gold. Roll El Dorado is paved with lapses. Joe Siegel, Go My America. It's a classic. Both kids and adults will love. No, Rosen, NYI. Have you seen Road to El Dorado? No, but I do not want to watch it. It was okay, in my opinion, but it really wasn't that great. It, and I don't want to. Birthday soon, Sam 2000. I respect your opinion. I thought it was okay, but it wasn't very good. The case is kind of damaged there. Next tape I got is... Hold on, let me get closer, because there's some tapes further back there. Next, Old Yeller, um, Neon Mickey release. Have you seen Old Yeller? Pretty good. Yeah, it is. Here's the tape, and the print date is December 22nd, 1986. Hold on. Hold on, guys. I'm sorry about this. I'm, just, I'm trying to get closer so I can... Show the ones in the back, too. Next is Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, MGM Family Entertainment. Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. Yeah, I like this movie. Tia Chick Certified. It is pretty good. Print date's August 17th, 1999. Next tape I got is Batman Anime Series Legend Begins from 2002. Print dates March 25th, 2002, January 28th, 2002. My cousin got me this tape. I have not seen Wait, I have seen it a couple times. It's okay. Next is Space Jam. And this is an okay movie. I used to think it was good. Now I think it's just okay. Wild, wacky, Juliet, adults, teens, boys, and girls will enjoy this movie. This movie says Gene Salad Today Show, NBC TV. I haven't seen that movie forever. Print dates January 10th, Take 7. Next tape I got is 101 Nailmations, 1999 VHS. And it's THX certified. Here's the Sibyl Jean Cisco. Here's the ink label and the print dates January 27th, Take 9. Climb shell is in really poor condition, as you can see. But it is what it is. Next is. The Great Mouse Detective from 1992. It's Magic, Joe Sale, ABC TV, two thumbs up, Cisco Niebert. Have you seen Great Mouse Detective? Yeah, it's alright. Have you seen 101 Dalmatians? The cartoon? Yes. Yeah, it's alright too. I like the live action version better. Um, the live action version was not too good in my opinion. Same thing with 102 Dalmatians. That one was almost garbage, but it was okay. But it was kind of garbage, I guess. Per day, it's April 3rd, and it's I respect your opinion. Well, kinda garbage. Kinda. But not really. Not, com not totally garbage, but just not that great. Very, very mediocre. Next is Sworn to Stone. Have you seen Sworn to Stone? I've seen all Disney movies, like I said. January 22nd, it's high four. Alright, then, what did you think of the Sworn to Stone? I'll just say that, then. What do you think it of the Sworn to Stone? actually pretty good. Not too much of a bad movie. I have to agree with you. Next is The Wizard of Oz. Have you seen The Wizard of Oz? Yeah, but to be honest, I hate it. I respect your opinion. I think it's okay. 
the greatest children's movie ever made since USA Today. Tia took certified. I know this is a classic movie, but it's okay. No label. Print dates June 13th and Tie 6. If you're listening to me, Bailey Suman hates old classics. I do respect your opinion. Like black and white movies. Next is Charlie Brown. Bon Voyage Charlie Brown, 1980 VHS. Really rare tape. And this tape came from Movie Palace 2. 4846 Chamber Road, Denver, Colorado. I live close to that, because I, I live pretty close to Denver. Like, only 30 minutes away from Denver. Actually, yeah. Next tape I got is The Rescuers. Have you seen The Rescuers? Yes. What did you think of it? Bad. It was okay, but I respect your opinion. A breath of fresh air, solitary, delightful cast of characters, says Lara Moulton. Here's the ink label and the print dates December 8th, 1998. And you know this is 1999 VHS. Pretty early. Next tape I got is Babe. A little bit, a little bit goes a long way. Have you seen Babe? I've seen Babe one and two. They're both really good. This first one's okay in my opinion, but I like the second one. Citizen Kane talking pig pictures. Then Geyer, Chicago Harry. I mean Derek, Derek, Daryl, Ugh, God, Del, Ugh, forget it. Harold. Fresh and funny. I mean. Fresh and original and funny he says absolute desire. Ugh, ass sorry, I cannot talk today. Ugh, God, <laughs> this is the worst yet. Fresh, original, <laughs> and funny and absolute delight says Larry Mullen Entertainment today. <laughs> this is the label and there's no print date on it. Next tape I got is. Next tape I got, I'll show that one a little bit later. Next tape I got is Lion King. Down 3 VHS, special edition, clown edition. Special features on there. Have you seen, I mean, oh, oh, what did you think of the Lion King? Pretty good. I like it. I, I saw, like I remember it. I saw it in the movie theaters in 3D, and that was pretty good. Print dates, August 6th, 2003. Stick, dark sticker label, blue tape. Do you want to see the blue tape, Bailey? Nah, I've seen it before. Okay. And I also have the sequel, Lion King 2 Simmons Pride Special Edition. Have you seen the sequel? The sequel suck. I respect your opinion. It was okay, in my opinion. The first one's the best. A worthy success for the throne, the most successful anime film ever ever made. I mean, of all times, is Scott Hendrick, the Los Angeles Times Syndicate. This was okay, like I said. Here's the tape. Then I was a rare tape, as you can see. Burnt dates July 29th, 2004. I also have the, the other sequel, Lion King One and a Half, which was not so great. I don't know the half of it. One. Actually, I ha I do know the half of it. Anyone who loved the Lion King will enjoy the Lion King One and a Half. This is Paul Clint, CNN. Yeah, right. Thought you knew the story of Lion King, you don't know the half of it. Yes, we do. Oh my God. That was the worst Lion King movie ever. It was okay, but it's just it was just not very good. Bird dates are December 30th, 2003, and December 23rd, 2003. Yeah, it was kind of bad, I guess. Next tape I got is The Aristocats. Have you seen The Aristocats? Oh, no, 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 no. What did you think of The Aristocats, I meant? The Aristocats? Yeah. Eh, not too good. I kind of liked it. I always kind of liked it because it had cats in it. just thought it was kind of cute. Bursting at the seams of have tickling fun to entertainment today. I did think it was pretty good because I just, I love the kitties in it. It's just that it was like really cute. Per day, February 29th, for Tay 6. It was per leap year that year. 
And you know what's even rarer? I have another tape printed the same day. That leap year. That's pretty awesome. That's pretty awesome and rare. Next tape I got is... Sorry, it's kind of hard to get to these tapes. 1994 VHS of the Fox and the Hound. Have you seen the Fox and the Hound? Yeah, it, it made me cry when I first watched it. Superior Lamarck Disney film, Josio Gomar America. I did think it was okay. I liked it. It's sad, though. Yeah, it is pretty sad. I did cry also when I first watched the movie. Print dates January 1994. Because it is pretty sad, too. Has that little touch in there. But it's still a good one, too. Next tape I got. I'm also I'm also hoping to get the sequel. I mean the um first and the, the first one the second one on Blu-ray sometime. I'm hoping to get the Blu-ray sometime. Next is the cuz I'm curious how that movie looks on Blu-ray. Next is Bambi 55th anniversary edition. It's certified. I'm hoping to I also have the 2005 Plam edition VHS as well as the 1989 VHS. Have you seen Bambi? Mhm. Mm it's also sad when the Yes it is. burning down. Yeah, that was sad. A perennial classic. Remember, long after other movies have been forgotten, says Roger Ebert's Kyle Sometimes. Birthdates are birthdates December tenth of ninety six. They're actually printed ninety seven though. Next tape I got is the nineteen ninety. Um, what year is this? Nineteen ninety. Now I'm going to show this one. I have two 1996 VHS tapes of Alice in Wonderland because one of them is damaged. I wonder which one of these are damaged. This one. As you can see, it's taped there. And the clamshell's in really bad condition. The part date's September 28th, 1996. And this copy is in better shape. And was printed June 9th, 2005. This one's in a lot better condition. Have you seen Alice in Wonderland? Yeah, it has to be the, my least favorite Disney movie. I respect your opinion. One, same with the Tim Burton remake with Johnny Depp. Oh yeah, the Tim Burton remake was not very good at all. It's awful. I, I wouldn't say it was awful, but I just didn't think it was all that good. Next is Prince of Egypt. Have you seen The Prince of Egypt? No, but I've heard of that. Dazzling Janet Maslin, New York Times. Spectacular says Karen Butler, UPI. This movie's alright, in my opinion. Burnt Dates, May 20th, 1999. It was all right, Bailey. I mean, I, I don't know. Um, now, when you look at it, I would not recommend it now. But I don't know. It's just I, I probably would not recommend it. It was okay though. Me Next day we got is laying the tramp. THX certified, fully restored. That and if you, oh, 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 sorry. Have you seen laying tramp? Yeah, that one was good. And I know there is a Platinum Edition VHS from 2006. I am planning to get that one. I never knew that existed. Guess what? I am I I did because Defense Fan 226 had that has that tape, I believe, but I I don't not sure if he has it anymore. I am looking for that tape. I'm going to try to I'm going to try to find it sometime. And I I probably got I probably get it. One of the Disney, one of Disney's most enduring classics is Chicago Tribune. Here's the tape, and there's a print date from August 28th, 1998. Lane the Tramp is a good movie. It's kind of sad too, but it's definitely worth a look if you haven't seen it. Next is the Jungle Book 30th Anniversary Edition. I also have the 1991 VHS with the rare vertical sticker label. Have you seen this movie? Which one? The Lion King. I mean, not not the Lion King. The Jungle Book. Yeah. 
It was I, okay. Yeah, it was okay, in my opinion, too. But the sequel sucks. The sequel sucks big time. Yeah, the sequel, I have to agree with you one. The sequel was awful. Memorable music, imagine adventure, all tree for ages. Of tree for all ages, says Dixie Watley, w, WC, VB, TV, ABC, Boston. Here's the ink label, print dates, September 27th, 97. Printed my mom's birthday that year. And that reminds me, my mom's birthday is tomorrow, actually, surprisingly. Yeah, my mom's birthday is tomorrow. Next tape I got is Chicken Run from 2000. The year's funniest movie, says Andrew Johnson, U.S. Weekly. This is a good movie from the career Walls of Gromit. Have you seen Chicken Run? Yeah, it's... An... I'm gonna say it's probably my least favorite DreamWorks animation movie. I respect your opinion. I like it. Superb family fun, says Tiffy Lines and Movie CTV. Two thumbs up. Roger Ebert, Roger Ebert, the movies. I have to admit, I like this movie. I also have the 2006 VHS and the slipcover. Birthday, it's October 7, 2000. I respect your opinion. And Bailey, I respect your opinion. Thank you. Because I do like it. Next day I've got is Bed Knobs and Broomsticks, 2001 Gold Classic Collection VHS, 3th Anniversary Edition. A thoroughly, throughout, a thoroughly entertaining fantasy says Larry Moulton Disney Films. Have you seen Ben Noms and Broomsticks? Well, no, no, no. Have you, have you, ugh. Have, what did you think of Ben Noms and Broomsticks? I, I remember, you've seen all of them. Well, I kind of like it. I mean, it's a guilty pleasure. I have to agree with you. Print dates, February 5th, 2001, January 31st, 2001. I have to agree with you. It's kind of, but it's still good to want, to look at. Next tape I got is 101 Dalmatians 2 Pets London Adventure, which was alright in my opinion. A charm of church to please fans of the original classics is Michael Skyfield, TV Guide. My and I just got 20% of battery remaining on my iPhone, so I'll try to hurry this. Dalmatians back and better than ever, Michael Troutman Family Magazine. I'm gonna try to hurry this up because my phone is at 20%. Print dates December 12, 2002. You know what? I'm going to plug my phone in now. So I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.